Hello and welcome to uh, my reflections on day 64 um, in a beautiful part of the world. I don't know if you can see that. Um, it is just fantastically stunningly beautiful. So my reflections on day 64. Day 64 is probably the most famous verse in the Tao Te Ching. Um, the Tao in day 64 says um, everything can be completed from here. Um, which is commonly discussed and thought about as the journey of a thousand miles starts with a single step. It is about breaking things down and recognising that, that everything can start from here because here is the only place that you've ever got. So it means therefore then, because I can't point to the past, it mustn't exist. Um, it means that I can't have any regrets about the things that I think I should or shouldn't have done because actually all I have is this point now. I can only actually start from here. So that's quite um, an important thing because it means that, that things can have a start and things need to have a start in order to be able to, to do that and to move on. It also means that, that actually a thousand miles and a single step is the step is the smallest unit of travel that we can accomplish just taking one step whether it be a big step or a small step it is a step um, and so my relationship with that is also it, it's about all things are achievable and um, making sure that we break them down in a way that is powerful and meaningful and useful in order to be able to achieve them so Yesterday I set out to achieve quite a few things um, and do you know what? I did it because it wasn't connecting with the enormity of, of what had to be achieved. It was just connecting with the simplicity of what was the basic unit of travel, which is just a step. Um, <clears throat> sometimes it is just a thought or an action and one action at a time and recognising that we are the sum of all our thoughts. We are the summation of all of our actions and so all we need to do is just to take charge of those things. One simple action and thought at a time in the direction of travel that is taking us to where we want to go to. So that means also sometimes we have to question that is this thought relevant to my life? When you think a rubbish thing about yourself, you say to yourself, is it taking me on my journey? And very often the answer is no. I mean, I'm sure we'll meet people that will go, you know, I thrive on negative feedback. Well, actually the research is such that that's not the case, <laughs> is that we, we actually thrive, um, you know, like a seed that's planted in the ground when it is nurtured and when, you know, it receives sunlight and it is watered and it is fed properly. And the basic unit of travel for all those things are glimmers of sunlight, drops of water, and nutrients from the soil. So whatever it is that you want to achieve, whatever it is your direction of travel, one step at a time, one thought at a time, one action at a time, break it down and sometimes just ask yourself, is this thought useful? Is this action useful? Am I taking myself in the direction in which it would be useful for me to travel? And if the answer is no, then maybe we have to learn to stop it. So your journey, a thousand miles. See you when you get there.